for me. Now right. you said you were the opening act for Jay Leno. Was that recently, or, um, or yeah, I've been. When he was, I've been. Uh, well, remember, Jay does the Tonight Show in Burbank, right, right, Monday right. through Friday, right. uh, and on weekends flies to uh, the Mirage in Las Vegas and sporadically does dates. And um, uh, but I do that a lot, not just yeah. for Jay. I mean, I do it for. I was just was with Joan Rivers and. Um, uh, well, he's picking out Canada, Kate because, Canada. you know, as you know, he's from the area. Yeah, he's from Andover. From, yeah, right. We talk about it. And when I got, and, you know, my, my mother's actually here today. It's, it's funny. Uh, uh, she's often backstage in jail, hold her hand, yeah, watching yeah, me. Yeah. And uh, it's really something else, man, to, to, to be backstage with Jay Leno. And Jay's pace, pacing back and forth, you know, uh -huh. just as yeah, much as yeah, right. I am. You, so would, you would think he wouldn't be. I know it by you now. Know, by <laughs> now. But I think that's one of the things that keeps him uh, fresh all the time is that he's, uh, he's still just as nervous. And he, uh, it's really fun to watch yeah. to see that. Um, mm -hmm. And for me, you know, it, it's... Uh, privilege to be working with these kind of people. I know that sounds kind of a generic answer, or, or, or everyone says that, well, it's a privilege, but really, I mean, it's amazing to me, because I remember growing up on Fifth Avenue and Garfield Street and Haverhill, and, uh, and to be, I mean, not a week ago, I'm having lunch and two tables over is Nancy Reagan, and, yeah, yeah. you know, so it's mind-blowing to me that uh, and, and it just shows you how small the world really is. Yeah. Uh, the illusion is that these people are so far right, right. Uh, away uh, from uh, you away, right, and, right. and not approachable, but really it's just a matter of the profession you're in. I, I, I'm in the same business, so I'm, I'm, I see a lot of these people, and it's pretty, pretty neat to watch, you know? I mean, Full House was awesome to do, and 90210, and uh, I mean, uh, you know, everything. I, mean, I did a lot of, like, the voiceover stuff, probably. Everything in your refrigerator I've said or sung. <laughs> anybody who has succeeded in the entertainment business, anybody, has been a wannabe. Yeah. You don't just be. Right. You yeah. know, you've got to go through your stuff and uh, set up goals and meet them. And yeah. fail. You have to yeah, fail yeah, that's true too. miserably. And <clears throat> a lot of detours along the way. Oh, yeah. yeah. One of the things uh, Frank Sinatra told me was um, I told him that everybody thought I was crazy back in where I'm from. He, you know, he was from Hoboken, New Jersey. <laughs> yes, right, right. And uh, I said, I'm from a little town, too. It, you know, it was much smaller, obviously, when I was 16. And I, um, I said that, uh, you know, everybody thinks I'm nuts and crazy. And, and he said, kid, if everybody thinks you're crazy, you know you're on the right track. <laughs> Isn't it the truth, though? Yeah. You can't make everybody like you. Right. You know, I wish I could. I wish there was a magic pill that you could give people and everybody loved you. Yeah, right, right, right. actually, there are pills like that. But, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, we'll talk about that on another time. But <laughs> I know what you mean. Uh, on another show that I'll right. uh, start up soon. Uh, okay. Uh, now we, we also mentioned uh, you just met somebody from this area <laughs> as well. One of the singers, uh, uh, rock singer. Oh, I, I was at. Um, uh, the Hard Rock in Vegas, uh, seeing Coldplay. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, right, right, right. And um, which was unbelievable. Yeah, um, I'm a huge fan of them. Great band, they're, yeah. they're, they're great, and I. But again, I get really uh, obsessive, compulsive kind of. Uh, <laughs> Sometimes I'm just just the way I am. I, I'm I tick that way, and I, and and uh, there was one song that they did that was like some 13 minute song. Yeah. And I'm like the kind of guy that you lose me yeah, yeah. after after a few minutes. <laughs> it's like, what? So, you're so I got up and yeah. I walk out and I'm playing Wheel of Fortune. And apparently this guy must have been the same as me because he also had to have walked out. Uh, and because we were both playing Wheel of Fortunes, I didn't know who the guy was and because uh, he looked so clean cut. And uh, the security guy next to me said, it's Rob Zombie. <laughs> and so I turned around and said, you're Rob Zombie? Uh, could, I really had to ask, Yeah, yeah. surprised, right, right. because I was surprised. You see the posters and he looks like, you know, you yeah, know, your worst all, nightmare, yeah, right, right. man. But, <laughs> but, it, but in person sitting next to him and playing dollar wheel of fortune <laughs> slots, never would have expected. But I've done that with like Dana Carvey and people like that when I was yeah, at the Desert yeah, Inn. Yeah. Uh, but yeah. Rob was but Rob the, Zombie, yeah, he and, was and from I the said to him, as well. I said, yeah. Uh, yeah, thanks for putting me back on track there. Uh, Rob, I, I said, um, uh, well, he said, yeah, I'm Rob Zombie. And I said, you're Rob Zombie. And he, 
And, he, and I said, I'm from, uh, we're both from Haverhill. You know that. And he goes, oh, Haverhill. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's what he said. <laughs> Thank you.